Hello guys, this is your boy Lisa Lanky and today in this video we will be creating our own cryptocurrency in just 5 simple steps. Now uh, it shouldn't take more than 10 minutes for creating your own cryptocurrency and the main motto of this video is to show you how easy it is to create your own cryptocurrency. Uh, it used to be tough back in the days but right now it's way too easy and anyone can create it. So let's just go over to our uh, desktop and start with the video. So these are the five uh, different steps that we need to follow. Uh, first, we'll be uh, installing the MetaMask. So let's go over to Google and search for MetaMask. Okay. Just add it to Chrome. Okay, add Chrome. Okay, so once it gets installed, it should open up a new tab. Okay, get started. Create a wallet. You'll be creating your own wallet. And uh, you have to set your own password. So don't forget this password. Um, confirm your password. And red and agree. Yes. So this is the secret backup phrase. You can see it uh, or remind me later. Okay, so this is your account and um, you can check it out using the extension itself you've installed MetaMask. So let's just go over to it. Close all the other tabs. And yeah. So it's done. Uh, install MetaMask is done. Now let's switch over to Testnet. So the testnet that we'll be using is Robston. So make sure that you've um, switched over to Robston test network. Okay, done that. Over to Robston, done it. Now let's receive some tokens for it. Uh, you don't have to buy any uh, tokens. It will just be a faucet. So faucet is basically um, kind of like uh, you can get unlimited uh, ethos from it so yeah let's connect our account and uh, okay it didn't go through okay yeah because i've been um, using it before as well so too many requests yeah okay so this worked uh, there is another faucet faucet dropstone.be uh, you can ask uh, your ETH from there, Ethos from there. So I've done that. I've gotten one Ether. Now let's go over to Consensus uh, GitHub account. Um, okay. So let's go over to Consensus uh, GitHub account. Search it. And now we have to go over to this particular repository, Tokens repository, Ethereum tokens contracts, and um, EIP20. So this is a protocol that we'd be following. Okay. So contracts, CIP 20 solidity contracts. Okay. So now let's uh, go over to remix and import the contracts there. Okay. Remix is basically an IDE for creating your own cryptocurrency. We are almost done. Um, you might not even realize it, but we are almost done. So let's just delete all of the files, previous files. We'll start from fresh so that you know uh, how to do it. Okay. And you can just follow me along. So yeah, uh, this is the blank slate and we'd be creating our own new file. Um, it should be named based on um, your tokens name. So here I'll be creating a new token. Um, Alinu token is the token's name. You can create your own and go over to eip20.solidity and just uh, copy paste the entire file in that. Okay, copy and paste it here. And uh, just know that uh, you have to create the contract on your own name. So uh, the token's name should be here instead of EIP20. So Ali new token is the token's name. And there's another um, place where you need to change here function Ali new token. So these are the two changes that you need to do. Other than that, everything is fine. 
okay so we need to create another file eip20 interface dot solidity because that's what we are importing so let's create that file make sure that uh, this is very uh, case sensitive so uh, eip is in caps lock and stuff like that so just make sure that you're copying it um, perfectly so let's go over to eip20 interface dot solidity you draw copy the entire file and paste it in your uh, remix id so yeah uh, that's been done now now you might not realize it but we are almost done with uh, making the cryptocurrency so let's just compile our uh, cryptocurrency now uh, keep it as the default compiler and compile it um, yeah it's been compiled and now let's deploy and run it so once you change to injected web3 it should take over to uh, metamask and just click next uh, connect it it's being connected and there it is uh, there's your account with one ether uh, there's the contract and let's deploy it okay okay there's an error oh i got it i got it so um, basically we were trying to deploy eib20 interface we don't want to deploy that we want to deploy our own uh, token so ali new token is the thing that we want to deploy so click over to that and then compile it so here you will see that compile ali new token is there uh, before it was uh, compile eib20 interface now there is a warning uh, just ignore the warning for now um, it's not an error it's just a warning so go over to deploy uh, do the same thing again okay um invalid arguments okay we have not passed in any arguments now uh, while deploying your cryptocurrency you need to uh, specify some arguments now these arguments are initial amount the amount of coins that you want initially uh, to be deployed uh, the token name uh, decimal units and as well as the token symbol so let's just um, fill it in i'll keep the initial amount to 2000 uh, doesn't matter it's on you uh, token name as ali new token that's what we had kept um, decimal units i don't want any decimal units and the token symbol would be a and d short for ali new token uh, let's do the transaction um, okay so contract deployment uh, let's just confirm it yeah confirm it and it's been uh, yeah it's been deployed uh, published ali new tokens metadata uh, everything has been published successfully you can see it so what this means is you have actually created your own cryptocurrency now to show it in action okay uh, this is the transaction fee that was uh, deducted so to show it in action let's just um, go down and um, see our deployed contracts so these are our deployed contracts this is the latest one that we are deployed and these are the things so uh, on here we can do everything we can transfer um, money we can see the balance uh, let's just uh, check our balance itself so our account address is here uh, 09b something let's just copy it and check our balance it should be um, yeah just uh, make sure that you put double inverted commas uh, before and after it so double inverted commas and here okay now we are going to be checking our balance okay so it should be 2000 let's see yeah it's 2000 uh we had deployed our uh contract or the token with initial amount as 2000 so whatever you keep as the initial amount it should be transferred to uh your account itself now let's see the name uh, why do i know that it's a new token so this is the name uh, this is the symbol a and d that we had kept and everything has been deployed uh, it has been deployed on the main net as well um, 
so you can even see it on etherscan that's what i'll be showing right now uh, check your transactions at uh, robston.etherscan.io so if you had other um, wallets as well you could have uh, done some transactions uh, with and that is alinu token um account let's just copy it and search our account so let's search it okay so there's a contract uh, contract creation 2 minutes ago so that's that's our contract um let's just copy our contract and um, search through our contract okay this is uh, my wallet now let's search for the contract so this page is your ledger uh, the kind any transaction that happens with alinu token would be listed over here uh, you can see the creator as well uh, creator has my um, 00x9 something uh, that's my wallet's uh, id So that's it for this video and if you like this video then do press the like button do share it with your friends and subscribe to my channel by pressing the bell icon as well so that you don't miss any new updates also a big shout out to SPIT they are coming out with their own esports fest so if you are a gamer or someone who loves playing games then do register for their events uh, they have among us valorant and my favorite one csgo so do check it out and register for it uh, all the details will be down in the description box below so register for their event as soon as possible and i'll see you all there